Hey what's up, it's Chris from Rooker Films and in today's video I'm going to show you this really cool time effect that you would typically see in old school MTV programs and this is a vinyl scratch slash time skip effect. So once you have Premiere Pro loaded and you have your footage imported and ready to go, we first need to find the point of the video that we want to apply this effect to. So once you figure out where you want to do this effect, we want to press C on the keyboard to load up the razor tool, make a cut in the video, scroll across a few keyframes, and then we'll make another cut. Now this cutout section in the middle of your video is the part of the video that we're going to add this effect to. So to avoid losing the last part of the video, we want to separate this from the first two sections of the video. So drag this last section of the video over to the right completely out of the way and we'll come back to this footage later on. Now you want to copy and paste the second part of the video so we have a duplicate section. So if you're on Mac you can hold Command C and Command V that should copy and paste the footage or if you're on Windows you can hold Control C and Control V to copy and paste. Now on this duplicated video you want to double click to load up this menu and go into speed slash duration and in this menu you want to press reverse speed. So select reverse speed and press OK and if we play this back you can see this effect is starting to take place but it is not long enough. So in order to extend the duration of this effect out we want to select those final two video clips so we've got the middle section and then we've got the reverse layer. So select both of these and we're going to copy and paste these a few different times. So command C, command V. And once you're happy with the duration of this effect, we can go and grab that final part of the video that we pulled over to the right, and we can pull this back up to the very end of the video. Now, if we play this back from the very beginning, you'll notice the effect looks really awesome, but just before the end, we have this weird skip. And that's because we're finishing on a reversed video. We need to finish on a copy of the video that is traveling forwards in time rather than backwards. So we'll copy one of those videos that is traveling forwards in time and paste that after the reverse layer. Pull that up to the video and then we can pull the end part of the video all the way back up and if we play this back, it's a nice smooth outro for this video. And there you go. It's really simple, it's really quick and that is how you do the turntable MTV style scratch effect inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe and check out the previous video if you want to see more. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next episode.